After an eight year dispute between the city of Houston and the Houston Fire Department, a tentative agreement has been reached to resolve the ongoing firefighters contract dispute. Yet yeah, Mayor Whitmire promised in his campaign to get this done within his first two months in office. KPRC 2 reporter TJ Parker is live this morning outside the firefighters union office on the near north side. So TJ, you spoke with the union president. What did he have to say about this deal? Well, guys, if you've lived in eight, uh, Houston for the past eight years, you know this has been an ongoing dispute for that entire time. And yes, we just spoke to the union president, Marty Langton, who was very enthusiastic speaking with us today that a tentative agreement has finally been met. He's not giving us the details quite yet because he says he wants his members to find out about this first. But take a listen to what he said to us about a half hour ago. To get to this task was monumental. Uh, this is eight years worth of acrimony of the past administration suing its own first responders who have stood fast during pandemics, floods, natural disasters, winter storms, and they have come to serve the public. And we have a saying that says, come hell or high water, Houston firefighters serve, and they have showed up every day, even though they were being treated the way that they were. So Mayor John Whitmire has been an advocate to get this all resolved, but the city said yesterday that all outstanding pay issues for firefighters dating back to 2017 will be resolved. This again comes just seven weeks in Mayor Whitmire's term, who committed to get this fixed in his campaign for mayor. The mayor adds that he will uh, ask for support from city council as well as Houstonians as they move forward with this. And we are also going to be speaking to Marty LinkedIn live coming up in the 8 a.m. hour of the live stream. Guys. Okay, so do we think that we might learn that um, details then and have a timeline? I know he wants to speak with his members first. Yeah, you know, we again just spoke with him about a half hour ago and we asked him about the details and he's understandably uh, he understands that we want to give that out to the public, but you can understand with him that he wants his members to know about this first. This has been a long time coming for uh, the firefighters here in Houston, eight years, as I had mentioned. So, of course, he wants the members to know about this and he says once those uh, people do, we'll be sure to uh, be uh, told as well and pass it along to everybody else.